Hi everyone. So today we are looking at Planet Maths page 95. If you don't have your book now, you can pause this video and go and open your book or go get your book. If you do have your book open on page 95, well done. You are off to a flying start. So we are moving on today to talk about something called chance. If we look at the blue box on this slide or on it's the same blue box that's on page 95, we can see a definition for chance. Chance is the likelihood, so how likely it is, that something will happen. For example, what is the chance I'm going to go to sleep tonight? What is the chance my mom is going to buy me sweets tonight? What is the chance it is going to rain today? What is the chance it's going to snow today? So what we're going to do is we're going to use three words that we can use to describe chance to answer a few of these um, different scenarios. So we're skipping part B question one. Don't worry about that. We're going on to Part B, question two. It says, look at the following sentences. What are the chances of each one happening? Write possible, impossible, or certain for each. So possible, impossible, and certain are three words that we can use to describe the likelihood or describe the chance of something happening. So if something is possible, that means that it might happen, but it might not happen. If something is impossible, it means it definitely won't happen. So, for example, what are the chances that um, what are the chances that I will win the lotto tonight? If I don't enter the lotto, if I don't buy a lotto ticket, my chances, the chance of that happening is impossible. I will not win the lotto. I will never win the lotto if I do not buy a ticket. What are the chances that I will win the lotto tonight if I do buy a ticket? It's possible. I could win. If I win it, if I buy a ticket, I could win the lotto. So it's possible. It's never going to be certain that I win the lotto because that's the game of it. You don't know if you're going to win or not. Certain means that you it's definitely going to happen. So what are the chances that I will sleep in my own bed tonight? Certain. I will definitely, definitely sleep in my bed tonight. What are the chances that I will eat breakfast in the morning? Certain. I will definitely eat breakfast in the morning. I eat breakfast every morning. My class will definitely know that. I love breakfast. I always have toast. Um, but anyway, getting back to our, uh, our scenarios here, we have to read the sentence and we have to decide, is it possible? impossible or certain. So what I'm going to do is a little bit like Dora the Explorer. I'm going to read the sentence. I'll give you um, a minute to think of an answer and then I'll say my answer. All right. So A, Wednesday will come straight after Tuesday. Is that possible, impossible or certain? Wednesday will come straight after Tuesday. Hope you have an answer. So that is certain. Wednesday always comes after Tuesday. So we can say the chances of this happening is certain. B, it will rain tomorrow. That one is possible. It's not certainly going to rain tomorrow. It's not definitely going to rain tomorrow, but it's not impossible that it won't rain, to that it will rain tomorrow. So that means it's possible. It might rain, it might not rain. C, it will get dark tonight. Yes, certain. It will get dark tonight. D, we will have no homework tonight. That one's possible. It depends on how much work you get done during the day. Uh, you might have a little bit of work left to do after school hours, but you might not. So that one is possible. Uh, e, an elephant will fly an airplane. Impossible. A, or like first thing, elephant probably wouldn't fit in the cockpit of an airplane. And B, it wouldn't even be able to uh, operate the buttons and the um, steering wheel that you'd need to uh, operate the airplane. So it wouldn't be able to do that. That one is impossible. F, I will have pizza for dinner tonight. This one is tricky for uh, me personally to answer because this one is really an uh, individual one. You might um, have an answer saying, impossible, I won't have dinner tonight, or a pizza for dinner tonight because we don't have it in the house. You might be answering saying, it's possible, yeah, my mom and my dad might give me pizza tonight, or if you're saying your auntie or your granny or your granddad, they might give you a pizza for dinner tonight, or 
for some people, they might know, yeah, I'm definitely, I know I'm having pizza for dinner tonight, so their answer might be certain. So we'll kind of skip that one because it's going to be different for everyone else. G, I will walk on the moon. Again, this one's kind of tricky. Some of you guys out there might want to become an astronaut, so it might be quite possible that you guys want to walk on the moon. But for some people, they might never want to go to space, and that's absolutely fine. So theirs is going to be impossible. Uh, for me personally, uh, if I was given the chance to go to space and I was able to be trained, I think I'd go. So I'm going to answer it's possible. Uh, H, the sun will fall out of the sky. That one's going to be impossible because the sun is held up in space by gravity. So um, it's not going to happen. And then I, Halloween will be on the 31st of October. That one is certain. Well done to anybody who answered that. Um, because Halloween is always on the 31st of October. So your task today is to go on um, and you're going to do, first of all, you're going to look at page 95, part C. I want you to look at that kind of peachy box. Um, there's a good example in that. And then you have to write one sentence for each of those pictures. Number one, the rainbow with the pot of gold, this uh, dark sky, and then three, today is Friday, tomorrow will be Saturday. You have to write one chance sentence for each of those pictures. Then you have to go on to page 96 and you're going to do part A. You have to write in your copy, um, are these things likely or unlikely to happen? So likely means that they probably will happen. Unlikely means that they probably won't happen. So you just have to write question one, likely or unlikely. Question two, likely or unlikely. Okay, that's all you need to do.